Now, if you've been to the cinema lately, you might have noticed that the most recent childhood character to come to the big screen is Sean the Sheep. That's right. And of course, our film guru Tom went to check it out. So, Tom, did the film pull the wool over your eyes this time? What did you think? Well, Brad, who would have guessed that to make me like a silent film, all you had to do was put a cartoon sheep in it? Um, the, f <laughs> <laughs> the film is the film's brilliant. It tells the story of Sean and the flock trying to trying to hunt down the farmer after he's lost in an unfortunate caravanning accident. I just, I don't know, maybe for me, because obviously I'm Welsh, this film would be perfect for me and for everybody else in Wales, perhaps. But um, I don't know. I mean, you went, when did you go to see it? Uh, I went to see it on, just yesterday, actually. Yeah, no, honestly, How many people were there? Let's there, be honest. There, there were no people there. It was just me. Brilliant. So it was just in the, No, 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 please let me, let me, let me finish. <laughs> I mean, first of all, the reason you need to see this film, and you really do, is because it's Aardman. The pedigree that comes with that, you know, Chicken Run, Wallace and Gromit, that Pirates one they did. These are all fantastic, wonderful children's films. They're the Pixar of the UK, and f English cinema needs supporting. I mean, come on, Tom. Maybe in your own deluded mind, but I mean, <laughs> you know, this is Sean the Sheep. I mean, are we getting to a point now where, you know, cinemas are starting to rip films from other children's TV programs? It's getting a bit ridiculous. I, I find this, this argument is brought up a lot now with the argument against adaptation versus original screenplay. And I, I don't think it's a fair one. You're creating a false dichotomy by saying this is art and that isn't art. Well, you, who are you to decide that just because this happens to be based on a plastine, plasticine sheep from a Wallace and Gromit short, that that is better than something like the pretentious Birdman that just sniffing its own self-indulgence. Oh, God, I hate that film. So just to sum up then, a rating at a 10, what would you give the film? I don't do star ratings, but I <laughs> I can say this, you'd be bleating mad to miss Sean the Sheep. There we are. Well, thank you very much for that review, Tom.